Hi everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hope you're all doing well. But this evening, I'm actually bringing you a video where I have been gifted some items. I'm super excited about them all and I can't wait to show you. Because of COVID and because of lockdown, independent and small businesses have really, really struggled. And I'm all about supporting them, all about helping people reach their goal and really be where they truly wanna be in life. Like a lot of other people, I have been searching high and low to find small businesses for the things that I would usually go to the big brands for. Things like mugs, plates, bowls, candles, fairy lights, everything, even down to clothes. I have been looking for independent businesses that I'm able to support in this really difficult time for them. Anyway, one of my colleagues, her mum has a small business and so excited that she wanted to work with me on this video. Her products are genuinely amazing. So I'm gonna tell you a little bit about the business. It's called Betty and Mojo. are actually based in the Wirral, which is where I live. If no one saw my first video, that is actually just across the waters from Liverpool. I will link it down below. And it is two women, my sisters, and due to COVID, they found inspiration and started up their own business. And I'm so glad that they did, by the way, because their stuff is just amazing. You'll see. Their business is homeware products, candles, prints, bags, baskets, mugs, plant pots, mirrors, frames, everything that you could ever think of to put in your home, they've got it. Anyone will agree with me, if you have a look at the website, you truly get a feel for who they are and what they stand for, and you really do feel like it's such a lovely, independent little business. So I got a few things from there. I can't wait to show you. I really hope you guys like this video, and if you do, please do give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe. So the first thing that I picked up from Betty and Mojo was a wall print. I love wall print. They are such a simple and cute way to personalize a room. I think that they're really good to like get your personality across. I picked up a quote and I'm in love with it. I'm just gonna take it out of the packaging so we get the full effect. So I picked up the quote that says, to the moon and back. Now I've actually got this for my boyfriend's mum. It's her 60th birthday on Friday. So she can't watch this video until I've given it to her. <laughs> Basically, this is a really special quote in the family. I think that she'll love it because she loves little quotes like this. They're all over the kitchen. They're all over the house actually. I'm gonna buy a black frame to put round it. This is just so cute. Now this actually only does cost £5.25, which I think is an absolute bargain. I've been looking for a good place to buy prints from. Every single place that I've looked, it's just a bit of a rip-off, to be honest. But that, for £5.25, a thin black frame around it, you've got yourself a really nice present there. And it's really thoughtful as well. On their website, they have so many more. There's actually a Harry Styles one that I have my eyes on. And I'm probably going to have to buy that. Next to show you, I actually got some storage baskets. I am... Um, an organized queen. I cannot stand being unorganized. I have lists for lists for the lists I need to do for the to-do list. Honestly, I cannot stand not knowing what's going on in life. So I have to have that in bedroom or in the house as well. But also I can be super OCD about these things. Finding something that's a storage basket but doesn't look like just a plastic box is really difficult because I always just want it to look pretty, you know? So when I saw these on the website, I absolutely fell in love with them. So you get one big one, a smaller version. This is the big one for comparison. A smaller version of that, comparison. And then an even smaller version of that, comparison. And the best thing is, is that they all fit back in together. I'm sorry, but if that is an organisation, then I don't know what is. I think they're so cute to have, like, to put socks in or little bits and bobs, even makeup or, or bras or tiny tops. I just think that they would be perfect. So these, for all four baskets, it's £55. I actually think this is a really good deal because the quality of them are absolutely insane. You can just tell how much love and care goes into each and every one of them. I just think that they're really, really nice. Really cute wicker baskets. Next, I picked up a gorgeous, gorgeous candle. I wish I could send smells through the camera because genuinely, this is the best thing I've ever smelled. It gives me spa vibes of being super relaxed. It feels like the air's thin, fresh, and mmm. 
so nice. So this is the scent of fresh sea breeze sea salt candle. The pot that it comes in is just insane. And then this is what it looks like on the top. But honestly, the nicest candle I have ever smelled. Beats Yankee Candle by a mile. I'm sorry Yankee Candle but I'm calling you out on that one. This candle is actually £19.50 and oh my goodness I think that that is so worth the price. You would normally pay like near enough 30 pounds for a yankee candle and they burn so quickly and in my opinion you have to get a really strong smelling one for it to actually smell whereas this it smells already like the room smells nice already and i haven't even lit it yet i think this definitely is a favorite so the final thing that i got was a bag so this is a tote bag it's got the word escape on it i can't wait to open it <gasps> Oh my god, I love it. Now this bag I think would be absolutely perfect for the beach. It is literally massive, like you could fit so much in here. Also the quality of it is amazing. I find usually with tote bags they are really quite flimsy and have no kind of skeleton or structure to them. And I feel like they never carry it as much as they look like they will. Whereas this one, it stands up on its own, which is such a good sign. The straps as well, brown leather straps, and they're so sturdy. It's not going to break anytime soon, put it that way. It's such a nice gap between the strap and the bag as well, because sometimes I find that it's way too long, and then the actual bag ends up hanging right down by your hips, or it's too short and you can't even fit it over your shoulder. But I think that this is perfect, and I absolutely love the writing on it. It's absolutely gorgeous. So they're actually all the bits that I picked up from Betty and Mojo. There were a few other things on the website that I just couldn't decide between. Also saw a beautiful vintage jug with flowers on it. And it was so lovely. I, I could picture it with some gorgeous flowers in. They also have some absolutely insane mirrors on there. Unfortunately, I've got no more wall space for a lovely mirror. <laughs> but for someone that might be looking for something like that, definitely take a look at the website. So I'll link the website down below. If any of you are interested in picking up any of these items, I do actually have a discount code for you all. If you use Laura15 at checkout, you will get 15% off and they do ship all over the UK. Please let me know if you pick anything up from there because I would genuinely be so made up if you did. Just remember, any purchase that you make, whether that be a £5 print or a £65 escape bag, every little helps to a small independent business and you're supporting local. I just think it's brilliant. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye everybody.